Alright guys, so today I'm going to show you how to launch a World of Warcraft as a non-Steam game so it shows up consistently. So let's get started. In order to do that, you are going to need to navigate to Steam. You're going to go to your library, you're going to go to add a game, add a non-Steam game, and from here you're going to have a few choices. The first and easiest choice is you click browse. You navigate to your World of Warcraft folder. So. Mine's in my F drive, World of Warcraft. And then in this folder here, you're going to scroll all the way down. And if you have a Windows computer, you're going to add WoW-64. If you're on a Mac, it's going to be WoW.app. So you're going to click that. You're going to hit open. I already have it done. So then what's going to happen is it's going to add it. Okay. So you'll go to properties here. WoW. 64.exe then when you go ahead you're gonna launch this if you want you can add it as a shortcut you right click create desktop shortcut to show you what that looks like this is what it looks like when I added it so now when I double click this you can see here on Steam it popped up now you can either log in through this okay this this version of the game or if you're like me and you really like the uh, Battle.net launcher, you can just minimize that, ignore it. It doesn't take up a lot of resources. And then you would just log in like normal through the Battle.net launcher. This also uh, gives you, you know, highlights of the day. Like yesterday was the Battlegrounds bonus event. I like being able to notice that kind of stuff. I like to be able to see who's online. I like having the Battle.net the Battle.net messenger up all the time. Uh, if I go AFK, I like to have it up, that kind of stuff. Um, and this will automatically log in for me. I don't have to retype my password or anything like that. Now, the other choice you have is to um, add a notepad. Okay? So I'll show you how to do that if you have a Windows computer. If you have a Mac computer, I have no clue what to do. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to your C drive. You're going to go to uh, Windows. You're going to go to... System 32 and in your System 32 folder is Notepad. Okay? So then you would click this, you would hit open. And what it's going to do is it's going to ask you, you sure you want to add Notepad? You hit yes, add selected programs. So now Notepad has been added. So we scroll up to it. What we do now is we go to properties. We rename it World of Warcraft. This will also work for any other games. It doesn't have to be just World of Warcraft. You can add a desktop shortcut. Okay. Uh, don't know where it, where it added it. Anyways, let's just launch it. Okay. Library, play, and as you can see, it now says I'm on World of Warcraft. Now, if I close that and I renamed it, let's see, World of Warcraft 2, play, I'm now playing World of Warcraft 2. So as you can see, it'll work for, you know, this is a quick way for games that are really difficult and don't and stubborn and they don't want to be added to Steam as a non-Steam game. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. 